before you watch the video skip to the next part make sure that you stop why because i might save your money and time we have prepensa prime subscription which is like netflix but for placement preparation and skilling training and certifications it has more than 200 plus courses like ai ml data science and this cloud full stack web development cg plus plus out by dsa popular coding aptitude even as micro courses for companies like tcs and pp pro deloitte zs amazon cisco qualcomm etc so all problem solved just with one single subscription and 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 not just courses just like a single subscription we also have a prep and stuff placement cell that has more than 400 plus hiring partners and we actually do refer you all of these companies once you complete our track for this Hello everyone, welcome back to another video and for this video we are going to discuss about DXC syllabus and recruitment pattern for the year 2023 and 24. Right. So with the placement season right near the corner dawning upon us, we are here to set you up with all of the important points that you need, the recruitment process, the assessment process and so much more about DXC because it's going to start off their selection and the hiring process very, very soon and we have the news, right? Okay, so let's begin here with the important details. But before that, let me tell you that we are here to help you out in your preparation journey and what could be better if you join us on our social media handles such as Instagram, WhatsApp, LinkedIn, Discord, Telegram so that we can help you out with our hearts open and get you placed in your dream job. Most important, at least follow us on at least three platforms, which is Instagram, WhatsApp, and LinkedIn, so that you get all of the important updates. We share the updates, we share the drives, we share the application links, and so on and so forth, and so much more to make it convenient for you to get placed. So make sure that you at least follow us on Instagram, WhatsApp, and LinkedIn. Also, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel so that you get notified whenever we come up with a new video. And in this placement season, we assure you that we are going to come up every day on your feed and drop some, something important for you to get placed in your dream company. All right, so don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and click the notification bell as well. All right, moving forward, another surprise for all of our viewers that top three commenters on this video are going to get a free Prep Insta Prime access. Isn't that a win-win situation for you? You're also getting preparation material, plus you're getting a Prep Insta Prime. Now, what is Prep Insta Prime? We are going to talk about it, dive into the world of Prep Insta Prime very soon. But before that, let's begin with the video and all of the information that you are here for. All right, so let's begin with the assessment round. So how many rounds does DXC provide or have for the entire uh, recruitment process? All right. So there are three main rounds is the most basic structure for any recruitment process. So you have the online assessment, technical interview and HR interview. So these are very basic common rounds on an assessment. We are going to discuss about the online assessment, its section, bifurcation, time limit, everything further in this video. So make sure that you stay up to the end so that you get all of the information that you are here for. And then we move towards the technical interview once you have crossed the online assessment we move towards the technical interview deep dive into your technical skills and so on and then finally we have the hr interview the deciding round all right that is all about the assessment rounds that you will be facing if you decide to set for the dxc hirings all right moving forward let's talk about the written assessment all right so Deep dive, the table is right before you. Everything you need is right there on your screen. So what do we have? We have six sections, all right? So we have English, Logical Ability, Quantitative Ability, Writex Pro, which we are going to talk about what it is. So let's keep it anonymous right now. And then we have Computer Programming and Automata Fix. All right, so this particular assessment not just talks about your aptitude, not just about your writing ability, not just about your technicals, but everything. It tests you in every nooks and corner of your personality, of your knowledge, and gets you placed in TXC. All right. So let's start off with the English section. So you have 12 questions for 15 minutes. The cutoff for this particular section is 9 to 10 questions. All right. So out of the 12 questions, you will have to pass through at least 9 to 10 questions. All right. Now, before moving forward with the entire details, let me tell you a quick disclaimer that according to our sources that we have connected with the TPOs and the college heads and everyone, the pattern for DXC right now is this what we are discussing. If there are any changes, we will update you. So this particular pattern is very similar to the last year pattern. All right. So you will be uh, it will be easier for you to practice and perform in the examination. However, if DXC decides to change any of the pattern or tweak anything here and there, we will be the first people, uh, first person to come and address it to you. All right. So don't worry, you will be updated in case of any change. 
if no change this pattern will be followed all right so let's uh, move forward with the details here then we have the logical ability sections so we have 14 question for the section 14 minutes so one question one minute and again the cutoff is 9 to 10 questions all right cool uh, then we have quantitative ability with 16 questions 16 minutes again very obvious at one minute for one uh, question now um i guess quant section for one minute one question is sufficient enough if you have a good speed so if you want to increase your speed make sure that you're practicing more number of questions and where do you practice from definitely prep insta and prep insta prime we'll talk about that very soon all right and then you have 11 to 12 questions of cutoff all right moving forward we have the write text pro section now what is this write text pro it is none other than essay writing all right so it tests your verbal uh, it tests your uh, vocabulary it tests it tests your fluency it tests your writing capacity all right so everything and anything that uh, deals with the essay writing portion it's right here in the write text pro section all right so you're going to get one topic for 20 minutes and there's no cut off definitely so you have to elaborate on the topic and write uh, in your own words a good essay right so we are going to discuss about that uh, later as well then we have the uh, computer programming section so you have 12 questions for this section and 15 minutes for the section all right and then the cutoff is seven to eight questions next finally we have the automata fix section which has seven questions in totals and you have 20 minutes all right so you have enough time for the seven questions to sit think ponder and then answer all right and then you have five to six questions for this particular uh, subsections of the first round all right so that's the table right before you if you want you can take a quick screenshot if not you also have all of the details mentioned on our uh, prepinsta.com page as well so once you come here you can see that you have all of the important details right over here right in case you are missing out on the video you can come over to our prepinsta.com dxc dashboard and get all the details over there all right so quickly uh, summing up the entire section is total time is 100 minutes and the total number of questions are 62 summing up this time limit and these number of questions all right so that was all about written assessment let's deep dive into each subsection and see what there is in it for you all right let's start off with the first section which is english so it's a basic english uh, verbal ability section all right so you are going to get all of the common topics that you generally a prepare for so let's say preposition conjunction reading comprehension synonym antonym speech tenses articles comprehension ordering selecting word sentence improvement and so on and so forth so let me quickly tell you that reading comprehension uh, sentence selection and correction improvement and subject verb agreement these are the most important topics that you will have to have to practice before you sit for this exam all right so they give a lot number of questions from these particular uh, topics so make sure that you have the basics of these topics at least brushed up till the advanced level all right so quick uh, check over here as well so the english section has 15 minutes 12 questions 9 to 10 questions is the cut off all right so we have already discussed this right uh, in the previous slide let's move forward let's talk about the logical ability section all right so again you have a basic logical reasoning of a moderate to uh, moderate to medium high difficulty it won't be very high difficulty all right so talking about the topics it's again the basic topics such as coding decoding directional sense logical word sequence arrangement syllogism inferred meaning blood relation and so on and so forth again letting you know that if you want to know about the important topics and you want to practice these sections over here, you can again quickly come over to our preminster.com dashboard and, uh, you know, move towards these sections. You have all of the links given right over here and you can pick up the topics that you want to prepare for. You have the mocks right over here and you can practice those. All right. So, yes, let's move forward. Let's move forward to the quantitative ability section. All right, if you want, you can quickly take a screenshot of the topics and the section bifurcation, time limit and number of questions. If not, you can head over to our Prepinsta Prime or prepinsta.com dashboard and get all the details right over there. It is there for you and it's the updated pattern. All right, moving forward to the quantitative ability, which is the third section. Let's talk about it again. Basic quant section, you have LCM, HCF, divisibility, profit and loss, time, speed, distance, pipes and systems. And you have many more topics which I cannot fit in over here. But definitely go and check out the page as well so that you get all of the topics uh, listed before you. All right. So let me quickly talk about the important topics. Now here we have profit and loss as an important topic. 
right? We have pipes and cisterns, we have time and work, we have allegation and mixture as an important topic. And there are many more topics which are important. So definitely go and practice from our dashboard. All right, do not miss out on the practice session, guys, because practice makes a man perfect. And if you're not practicing, you will not be perfect enough to get placed in TXE or whichever company that you are aspiring for. All right, quick bifurcation of the time and questions is right in front of you. 16 minutes, 16 questions and 11 to 12 questions is the cutoff for you for this particular section. All right. Okay, moving forward. Again, quickly dropping you a reminder that if you are still not connected with us, I don't know why you're not connected with us. But if not, make sure that you are there with us on at least the social media handles, the descriptions of the same will be, uh, the links for the same will be there in the description, I'm sorry. Uh, so you can go and follow us from there. So uh, follow us on Instagram, WhatsApp, Discord, LinkedIn and Telegram, especially on Instagram, WhatsApp and LinkedIn because we drop the important updates, preparation patterns on Instagram. On WhatsApp, you get all of the application links and important hiring updates and on LinkedIn, our um, Mentors and everyone can connect with you directly and talk to you, resolve your queries, especially on this, uh, as well as on Discord as well. All right. So make sure that you are connecting with us and do not miss out this opportunity to get connected with us and, um, you know, be with us in your journey of preparation. We would love to do that. All right. Now, before moving forward, because we have talked about Prep Insta Prime, let me just quickly take you and give you an introduction to what is Prep Insta Prime. All right, so this is what our Prep Insta Prime looks right now. So we have a cool um, trailer video going on. If you want, you can sit and watch that as well. So since we were talking about the aptitude section right here, so let me quickly take you into the aptitude section. So we have uh, a lot number of sections a lot number of questions. We have courses which you can practice for the aptitude, right? So we have quantitative aptitude, logical reasoning, verbal, DI. And we also have the entire essay writing section for you to practice. We have the basics of essay writing. Uh, we have rules of essay writing, what you should follow, what not you should follow, the do's and the don'ts and everything is completely summed up and the course is there only for you, right? So make sure that before you're sitting for this particular examination, you come cross check all of it and then set for it so that you know the rules and you don't go beyond it right so that you're in a safer zone and if um, there's also some uh, automata fix questions and computer science questions as well so you can quickly come down on a technical area and also practice uh, automata fix questions as you can see right over here right so you have the automata fix questions then you also have popular skills like the technical uh, the technical interview focuses on three things, projects, skills, and your resume, right? So skills, we got you covered. We have the latest skills that the market is looking for right now, which has data science, data analytics, artificial intelligence, ML, uh, QA analyst, and so on and so forth. So if you want to be one of those, uh, you know, uh, needed candidates or one of those asset candidates, the skills are important for you and you can get all of the skills right from Prep and Star Prime. Right. So we are going to again talk about Prep Minister Prime very soon. But before that, let's get back to our information and let's come to section four, which is Write X Pro, which is essay writing, to be honest. OK, in layman terms, it's essay writing. OK, so there are just few terms and pointers that we have added so that you know how to write an essay. So first is analyze the topic, arrange the point systematically, state the pros and the cons as needed, provide analysis in the conclusion and keep your word limit up. 400 words all right so those are the um, most important points that you have to keep in mind when you're writing an essay however we also have a complete table on what will be uh, how will you be marked what will be the negative marking where you will get the positive marking and so on so you can check that from this uh, from this table as well also we have a complete course like i told you and you can go and check that course out on prep and stuff prime and get your essay writing skills sorted Right. So again, let me quickly uh, talk about the time and question. So you're going to have 20 minutes to complete one essay and the topic will be just one topic you will be given and you have to write on that for at least 400 words. All right. So that is all about the essay writing section. If you want, you can also come over here and just um, scroll down up to here on this page. Just come down to essay writing. And once you are on this page, you also have some basic sample um, topics sample questions, sample essays as well for you to refer and understand on how to write a particular essay, right? So you can come down and see the analysis here as well. The do's and the don'ts are stated for you, right? And then you also have topics. 
like see for example you have the essays here as well so you can quickly go and check this out and see how to write an essay that can get you selected all right moving forward we have the automata fix section section 5 that is so quickly arranging the data of an array in some specific order, comparing the two given strings, finding sec second largest or smallest element of the array, finding some specific element in the given data and fixing the code for some popular searching or sorting like uh, trees and graphs and everything. All right. So again, all of the important details will be there on Prevenster Prime and Prevenster.com. Automata fix total time limit is 20 minutes. Number of questions is seven. So you have enough time for the seven questions to be completed in 20 minutes right and then you have five to six questions as the cutoff so it's going to be a little difficult than the other sections as i would say so it's very important that you practice for this section as well and you get your technical skills very very clear all right and that can be done clearly from this section on prep and Supreme, which is the automata fix a complete course is dedicated to automata fix all right so it's going to make your preparation journey way easier than you've thought and then we have computer programming, the last section of the written assessment. So we have basic programming, data structures and the OOPS concept as well, right? So basic programming contains all of the topics that are listed right before you, data structures as well, and then OOPS concept. All right. So quickly taking you through this, what, how will Prepista Prime be helpful for you for computer networking is we have the entire DBMS computer networks. SQL, SDLZ operating system, right? So oops and everything we have here for you to prepare from. And then we also have data structures once you come up on the coding section, right? So we also have data structures for you. DSA in C, C++, Java and Python in whichever term you want. Or we also have DSA for service and product based companies separately. All right. So it's going to help you out to again prepare for this entire section in the best way possible. All right, again, you have 15 minutes, 12 questions and seven to eight questions is the cutoff. All right, so that was all about the computer programming uh, section and that uh, has been complete assessment syllabus. All right, so section one, two, three, four, five and six, you have six sections in the written assessment round. In the first round, clear that and then you move towards the technical interview, clear that and you move towards the HR interview, clear that and voila, you are placed in DXC. All right. Important pointers that you need to need to know before you sit for the DXC examination. First is there is no negative marking. So it's a holy grail, holy opportunity for you that there is no negative marking. So even if you go wrong, you will not be marked negatively. Your scores will not go down. The exit test is adaptive. So I'll quickly tell you what adaptive is. Adaptive means that the more a number of questions correctly, you are answering the higher the difficulty of the questions will be if you're answering incorrectly the difficulty will not increase all right so that means it is adaptive and dxc uses amcat as the assessment platform all right so that was the important information that you need to know before you sit for the examination again more important pointers will be there on our dashboards as well so definitely go check that out don't miss out on the informations finally we have the interview rounds we have technical and the hr interview again in every section, Prepinsta Prime is going to be a friend to you, a guide to you, a teacher to you. So for the technical interview, we have the entire technical skills and the projects. Like I told you, you will have to need a projects in the technical interview because they look at your projects and see how sincere you are. So we have exciting projects for you, which you can choose from Netflix movie recommendations, Zomato analysis, image based, a species recognition and so on. And then we also have a complete HR course for you. For the HR interview preparation, once you come down on the interview plus section, we have the entire HR prep for you, HR interview course, which is going to help you out to prepare for the HR round, right? So let me quickly tell you that don't miss out on the preparation, guys. It's very important that you come prepare and set for the examination. All right. Again, quickly letting you know that we would love to be a part of your preparation journey and be your helping guide to you. So make sure that you're connected to us on social media handles such as Instagram, WhatsApp, Discount, LinkedIn and Telegram. The links of all social media handles will be there in the description box below. So go check those out. Um, also, let me quickly tell you that for Instagram, we have dedicated pages for dedicated batches. Let's say that you are from 2024. So we have 2024 batch. You can go and follow that page. If you're from 2025, you can go and follow our 2025 page and if you want to uh, follow the all of the details and all of the updates you can follow our off-campus page right over here just click on this link and it will direct you to the instagram page all right so that is going to be convenient so you can just filter out the mess and stay concentrated on what is your aim 
All right. So that was all about it. Quickly subscribe to our YouTube channel so that you get notified whenever we come up with a new video in this placement season. And I tell you that we are going to come daily to drop something important for you to prepare for your preparation journey. Right. Again, so talk to your commenters on this video. I'm going to get a free episode prime access. So make sure that you go ahead, start brainstorming, start comment. You can comment anything about your experience with prep inside, any query that you want to be resolved or anything that you would want to share with us so that it can help us and the fellow students as well to, you know, get informative and get knowledge in their preparation journey. So that was all about this uh, particular video. So we'll see you in the next video with more information, everything that you need to get placed in your dream company. Thank you so much. That's it for this particular video.